All right, so we're gonna tell you how to remove a shelf. The first thing, as always, make sure the machine is unplugged. There's also a power switch. Make sure this is in the off position, which is the up position. To remove the shelf, there'll be some releases on some of the machines, not all, but you can pull this out. And you'll see there's some zip ties that come from the factory. Some, if you've already pulled the shelf out, these will already be off, but if not, you're gonna have to snip them, just like so. Just need some snips or scissors or anything to get these zip ties off. Once that's off, you'll see the harness running to the back of the shelf. There's going to be like a little connector. You'll have to pop this off, it's just like a motor cover, and then you'll disconnect it. And then once this is out, lift the shelf up and pull it right out. And you'll see that's the whole shelf. That's the harness that we disconnected. And that's pretty much it. To put it back in, I'll show you how to do that. Just line up these wheels that are on the side onto the track. Kind of lift it up and you will have to plug this back in so you have to get that harness which is here and then you'll see the connector here and you just connect them in and that's basically it slide that in lock these in place and that's how you remove the, the drum